Hello, good evening. This is Weber from Base Camp of Lake City, <laughs> the Jule Cafe here. A nice place to visit. And talking about Lay, Lay is one of the heaven on earth, what I feel so. That's why I'm here for the fourth time. I've been here with my family and other three times and been solo. Wonderful experience. It is getting connected with the people more and more. And I am really proud that being in India, we have such a nice tourist destination where we can visit multiple times and feel the glory of nature in multi-dimensional way. If you come to the winter, which I am visiting for the first time for the Chadda trek, it's all totally different from what I had visited during the summer. So, for all my traveling fans all over India, a, a word of advice or a message, come down to Leh and explore the different dimensions of nature of the Himalayas. You can find the serenity, the traditional lifestyle, the beautiful nature which is yet unexploited by the tourist and they have maintained the ecosystem in such a nice way that every time you feel that huh, you should come back again with more friends. Mm, lay. This is my fourth time as I told you, first time as a bullet rider from Delhi back to Delhi with five of my friends. Next time as a cyclist riding from Manali, Lake Kardungla. Third time as a trekker exploring to try to summit Stoke Kangri, the highest trekkable point of India, which very few people of India are aware of which is about 22,000 feet above the sea level and this time it was the winter chadal trek. Just yesterday itself I have successfully completed my chadal trek and by God's grace it was just another heavenly feel. The feel of walking on the glaciers with the flowing water beneath your feet, it's really mesmerizing come down and experience it and years to come during the winters it will be very much easily accessible for the tourist so plan in your bucket list of adventures to have a chadar track hi good morning it's morning about eight o'clock after that freezing night frankly to say the glacier walk is really a nice feel but the nights we happen to spend after 4.35 o'clock till morning 10 o'clock it's really a very deadly experience the temperature moves down below minus 25 and even after four and five layers of socks and uh, clothing, our body gets frozen. Every minute in the night to be spent becomes a challenge and the mind game starts whether to return back from here or to continue. So it's a sheer challenge, not a proper sleep, very killing cold yet trying to move along with the challenge. Superbhatam as 26 January 2020 Bharat ka Ganatantra Din aur aaj hum hamare is chadar trek ke aakhri din pe pahunch gaye hai ek sunera ehsaas ek shital ehsaas कल की रात बहुत ही सर्दी भरी थी मैं कहना चाहूंगा कि जो सुहाना नजारा इधर हम देख सकते हैं बर्फ बर्फीले पहाड़ियों में उतना ही कठिन रात होती है इधर एक-एक 
लम्हा निकालने के लिए एक तपस्या जैसी हो जाती है और उसी से हमें एक अलग अनुभव मिलता है जिंदगी में कुछ सीखने के लिए और इसी अनुभव को सीखने के लिए हम इधर आए थे जैसे अयोध्या के प्रभु राम का वनवास परसों बाईस तारीख को खत्म हुआ वैसे ही हमारा जो हिमवास है जो हम चद्दर ट्रैक के चार दिन हमने गुजारे उसका भी आज आखिरी दिन है तो दोस्तों सी यू ऑल एंड यू कैन ऑल्सो प्लान फॉर दिस ट्रैक बट यू शुड बी वेरी लकी बाय वेदर एंड हेल्थ ऑल्सो सी यू सून बाय बाय At lake, you can come down with your kids, families. It's so serene. I don't think anywhere in India you can have this experience. So, so many new things are in the list for the lake. Come down and enjoy this different way of living at the serene bosoms of the nature. You have the ice here. You have the glaciers here. You are the highest trekkable point. You are the highest motorable point. You have very good cafes and restaurants. Good hospitality. very professional tourism government uh, facilities so all my indians and foreigners i as a tourist i am very much uh, overwhelmed to be the passionate visitor of lake again and again and repeatedly i will be back here and last but not least if you come down to lake please do visit Jimmy's Jule Cafe. It has its own uniqueness, which you will rarely find anywhere in India. See you all soon in Leh. Bye. Yeah, I am Vibhav Virnekar from city of Belgaum, Karnataka, which is the border of Maharashtra, Karnataka, and Goa. As a profession, I am a jeweler, wholesaler. being the president of the jewelry association of belga and also the vice president for karnataka for ipja indian bullion jewelry association which is 104 years old organization of india and also a council member for the south india for gjc which is another elite organ uh, council of indian jewelry association as a practitioner i am a yoga practitioner very profoundly practicing yoga and i can totally dedicate all my positiveness and endurance to the power of yoga yoga has changed the dimension of my life it has made me so strong that i can withstand most of the very tedious and uh, stressful experiences which usually it's difficult for a simple businessman like me so do practice yoga regularly and follow it as a part of your life i am also a cyclist i am also a biker i am also a trekker and try to be a simple human being <laughs> that's all i can say